They say a picture is worth a thousand words, but it's those words that help tell a story. To conclude a busy year at the Lee's Rages Art Gallery located in the Tumon Sands Plaza, an art exhibit appropriately titled Pictures That Tell a Story opens on Saturday, December 3rd. It's an exhibit that was made possible through a partnership with the University of Guam Press. Via Defont is a publicist for Yoji Press and says they had recently received a grant from the Guam Council of the Arts and Humanities and wanted to focus on a project that would showcase the artwork from the books they've published and other island illustrators. We were actually very excited when Don reached out to us and said, hey, you know, I have this exhibit idea and I want to feature these illustrations and paintings that tell a story. And we're like, oh, perfect. You, you know, we have a bunch of stories. We know a lot of talented local artists who would be interested in this. And um, it kind of grew from there. According to Don Lee's Rages, manager of the Lee's Rages Art Gallery, about 15 artists are expected to be featured, covering different genres and using various mediums. Defont says there will also be a handful of free workshops that the public can take part of. They'll be led by three artists who have all worked on Yoji Press publications. The first one is a Gyotaku workshop with Ralph Yurt Pataxel. Our second workshop is a lino cut workshop with Tonya McDaniel, who's done a couple pieces for Storyboard. She's also the collage cover artist for our book Dry Nights. And the last one we have is with Jessica Perez Jackson, and this will be a paint along workshop. Uh, Jessica is the illustrator of our very popular children's book, 13 Months in Molesu. So I know a lot of people are excited for that one. Seating is limited, so if you are interested in any of the workshops, you can register via a Google form that can be found on UOG Press's Instagram and Facebook page. Both ladies hope that people come out to view the exhibit and learn more about the artists in our very talented art community who have illustrated books, local legends, or have their own stories to tell. Just come by. It's a, it's a nice experience to look at art in. And, um, it never fails to happen every time I put up an exhibit, people come and they go, oh my God, I didn't know you were here, or oh, this is wonderful, I've never seen anything like this, and so, you know, I think it, it's just a nice thing to do. It's very different seeing the original artwork from, you know, in person than seeing it in a book. It's still beautiful, but there's an extra layer of just awe. You see the texture of the painting, you see really how much effort was put into you know these canvases these um, these boards and you're just kind of amazed by in a way that you can't really be in a way that's different than seeing it on a book Jonah Goncharfris KUAM News